is Tuesday morning at 8.45, and it has already been an interesting lead-up to our trip. <laughs> Austin was going to go pick up the rental car yesterday. Uh, he got to the rental car place. Uh, he had forgotten his password because he cleaned out his backpack recently. So <laughs> then they said, you can't pick it up. So he spent five hours going to Lyon and coming back and waiting at the rental car place, all not to get the rental car. Um, we started to pack last night and the kittens were sitting in one of our suitcases so we just left it open overnight and <laughs> good old Sebastian peed in the suitcase. So Austin got up at 6 45 this morning to head to Lyon to try to get our rental car and uh, I woke up <laughs> to clean the pee out of the suitcase and on the way to Lyon he just spilled coffee all over his backpack. Honestly. Kid! Hi what you doing? You're not even required to be in there. We are finally done packing. It's 1.30 and... Well, no, actually it's 1.10. It's, we're supposed to leave at 1.30 to go to the place. So before <laughs> we get to the car, I'm simply telling we Regan to prepare herself <laughs> and not freak out if it's a little small. Well, European size, then we'll make everything <laughs> Oh. Maybe we'll reach speed on the highway. Yeah, yeah, maybe we'll get up to 130 <laughs> kilometers an hour once or twice, but uh, it might be where are we? Surprise! Doo -doo 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 -doo. We got upgraded. <laughs> After the disaster yesterday. Oh yeah, we'll have plenty of space. the cats were going to use the litter box while we were driving because normally they're so anxious in the car that they don't they don't want to use the litter box however sweet sweet little Sebastian who's you know very large uh, he he tried to use the litter box but when we just have a little carrier top for the litter box so so we just use it to carry but like when we're in Airbnbs and stuff we take it off because he's too big and his butt doesn't fit in all the way so Sebastian climbs in the litter box which doesn't have any litter in it and starts to poop and his butt is outside of the box sure enough we pulled over quickly all the suitcases slid forward honestly we're gonna be smooth sailing if we ever just make it to our our Airbnb adios mio you guys we'll make it we'll get it done Hi. Hi, little man. Good morning. We have just left the apartment, which, ooh, it's like nicer than we thought it was, our little cheat. A cheat, it's a cheat. <laughs> the kitchen is super nice, super modern, and the shower, it has both rainfall or a jet. Like, it's nice. So, that was nice, um, but we woke up kind of, I mean, not really, it feels early France time. We woke up before 9 a.m. <laughs> Uh, and then we had some coffee, prepped our little like drone and things, and uh, moved all the footage that we shot yesterday. And now we are on the road to go to Sisteron. Sisteron, if you don't say it in a French accent. Um, so we're gonna see that. We looked at it online. Thank you, Google Maps, which pronounces things really funny. <laughs> they said Avenue yesterday. Sisteron. <laughs> Sisteron. Um, so we're going to Sisteron and it looks like this village that's kind of in the side of a mountain. We were just looking at pictures on Google Maps when we decided where we wanted to stop on our way to Nice. 
Um, so we're gonna go see that this morning, um, ask their tourism office to see where there's a hike, um, take some photos, and today's just kind of like a relaxing day because on Friday I work again, um, and we'll be in Nice. So Nice is kind of like our city. Today we're doing some, some fun nature stuff. And eventually I'm gonna figure out how to use this like little <laughs> suction cup mount for the car so I can mount the GoPro, but uh, it's really stumping my brain right now, which makes me feel darn stupid. <laughs> but we'll, yeah, we'll keep recording today. That's it. <laughs> miles into a hike to what's it called? Le Trou de l'Argent, which means I believe the money hole. <laughs> this sounds way better in French. I'm pretty sure Trou is hole. I'm pretty sure. Because we're going to like a cave. Yeah. yeah. Um, How are you doing Regan? On I'm first tired and I'm out of shape because I haven't been working out, haven't been running or anything. Oh. Um, but at this point we're actually higher than the Citadel. Uh, I can't show you because there's trees but. Point it that way. It's that way. I think they can see you because it's pretty wide angle. No, 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 I meant the camera pointed down the trail. Oh, I think they might be able to see it. It's over there somewhere. Just around the river bend. Well, anyway, that's it. There is, there is the citadel that we hiked up to earlier. Oh my God, I just climbed up metal ladder on the side of a mountain into a cave. And I think it's the scariest thing I've ever done before, but I did it and I'm like... <sighs> so there's Austin, and there's a little steel rope, crowbar, steps. McDonald's. They have a really cool ordering thing. Like when you go in, um, you actually order at a little machine. So the fries aren't as good, in my opinion, but they do have little potato wedges. He got a ranch sandwich. It looks like that. They have ranch sandwiches as a little promotion. We also got some chicken nuggets and I got a double cheeseburger. And the menu was surprisingly not as different as I hoped it would be. There weren't like baguette sandwiches or stereotypically French yeah. things, unfortunately. I saw an advertisement for a Roblochon burger when we were somewhere. Yeah, I see that. I think it was when we were in Geneva. I feel like the, the Frenchy, like, that are different from the actual American stuff are just their promotions. Because I think this McRanch, this McFirst you got, is a promotion. Mm -hmm. It's like stuff with ranch. But yeah, there were like Roblochon and like raclette and Savoyard burgers in the fall that we saw. Mm -hmm. 